Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing well. Hope you're having a magical day. And this video makes today even more magical because today we're doing a Lilic Monday and we have the final two songs from the album Chain of Thorns revamped version. We're doing the final two songs called Mythical Creature and Hit the Lights. I remember how I really really liked Hit the Lights but also how Mythical Creature was kind of strange and interesting too. So both of the songs are really cool and I just want to see if there's any changes, in what way. Um, last time I was informed that mainly like the drums and the kind of bass was kind of different than usual. So yeah, I'm interested to see what's now going to change and if we can spot it. So let's get ready. We'll have, it's an audio one. And after this, of course, like we have the album and stuff, but after this, next Lilic Monday is going to be the covers. The covers are coming. You guys have been dying to check, to have me check out the covers, which is really, really cool because I am really, really excited too, because they've started off with the covers in a way, but I really, really wanted to check out their albums and stuff uh, before I got into them. Uh, because they have some more like recent covers as well so I wanted to build up with the whole of the covers and then like see the whole of the albums so I thought since the albums are complete it's better to get on with the albums first and then do the covers all together you know till the earliest one it's really really cool because there's a lot of them and they are all really really interesting like to check out so Let's start with uh, Mythical Creature Revamped. Let's see how different is this going to be. Mythical Creature You're driving me crazy Wow. <laughs> okay, she's already wilder than before. <laughs> I love this guitar. Okay, what I want to point out here is until now, I can hear Melody being a lot different. Like I can hear her really, really being able to control her voice in a way that she gives out more power. Um, I love the guitar and the drums and the bass, all the instruments just all together, just so powerful. And I think that's just like the, the song itself. Um, and I just mainly like just enjoy the song overall, like as a whole which I think is just like key first of all. It's really important. <laughs> and it's just really, really interesting how with her voice and how they are stopping and like working on with the music as well. Like I can like hear like pauses and how she controls her voice in a way that really, really make the song pop out in a lot of like different like ways. It goes like, like a nice wave of change and then it's like slower and stuff. Um, so it's really, really cool because if it was like a plain one or if it was completely identical to the original one, um, which I think it's not like I can hear her voice being a lot like she, she really, really knows the song this time and really, really controls it. If you know what I mean. I love this bass part. I love especially this part. It is really similar to her original, but it's such a good like part. Like there's no reason to change it. Just like how she's handling her voice around here. Really good. Ooh. 
That was a bit of a short kind of guitar solo. I like the, the start, like how high that note was. It was really nice and really like contrasting. That was the guitar solo. That was a short one. Ooh, okay, 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 okay. The pausing of the music is What's really, really interesting here is how they're working with the ending. Um, I'm not sure if this ending was like in the original, but it's so like, it's like something's missing and then it's not like the changes they've done. And they're so like, also like her voice going from like, Like that change, anyone can hear and spot that. And I think it was intentional just to like grip you until the end. You're like, ooh, <laughs> you know what I mean? Ah, oh, that was interesting. I feel like I've just rediscovered a new song or something. Ah, <laughs> oh, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not sure if it's because I just didn't listen to it a lot listen recently. Or if it's because there's so many changes on it. Um, like, I don't remember the guitar solo being that small. But if I really think about it, I really, really focused on Melody's voice. And how I really enjoyed, like, the music and the bass. I think in the original reaction commentary as well. Oh, interesting. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Okay, we're doing, I'm gonna do hit the lights. That was a really interesting surprise. I, I'm not sure what what I'm gonna end with here in hit the lights. I kind of remember this song. Let's see if it's kept the same. I love that start. Okay, I just I just love that start. It's one of the best starts. I just really enjoy it. It's just like in the story when they tell you like write a narrative or something, and all the teachers are like start with the interesting part. So that you hook the examiner <laughs> doing an English lesson. <laughs> but like that's what everyone tells you. And it works with music too. <laughs> so yeah, it's one of my favorite starts here. Like it's just such a cool beginning. Okay, okay, okay. It's so clean. Like, it's too clean. Like, from the instruments to the voice, it's super clean and spot on. It's crazy. Wow.
quick okay, before we continue what i love here is how like melody's voice is being like surrounded by the music especially like the guitar just like surrounding her and complimenting her it's so it's again so clean it's so nicely like separated that they complement each other so well because you can hear each element so so well it's so nice it's such a like a different song from mythical creature where the song blended together to bring you something like as a whole this one it's because it's so nicely like separated and distinguishable as like a the instruments and music that you get this kind of like idea of like and music like everything i don't know <laughs> Wow. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, this part is just amazing. <laughs> now I remember why I like the song. <laughs> okay, I... Oh my god, her high note this time just reached like a whistle kind of like thing going on. Oh my god, that was crazy. And then that guitar solo just like... That change there was so nice. When it like hit, it just complimented the voice, the high note, and then it just went and then it, 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 it just changed and it just like went down just it, what the heck is going on this is so cool okay okay wait here here see like it just hit that was beautiful and then like the a height of the high note was like covered by like and complemented with like how fast the guitar was going and then it like completes it with like going like deeper like like it keeps the speed and then that was so nice like i could picture like 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 a lava kind of situation going like <laughs> so cool i love that okay go back <laughs> That was a nice heavy note. Oh, a nice sharp ending full of music, a nice clean tempo. This song is so clean, so arranged perfectly. I love it. It's beautiful from start to finish. It's so cool. Um, and the guitar solo just like complements the voice and the high note part so well. Like it's amazing. I love it. I love how it's like at the speed of the height of the high note. Like it's up there and the speed is like that fast. Oh my god, it just descends and then it just but it keeps like a steady kind of like descent. It's like like a sharp one. It's like a slowly going down there. It's still keeping that fast pace and then it's like something happened, something occurred, and like it was something completely new. 
it's crazy oh my god my voice is changing my bag uh, <laughs> oh my god hit the lights is one of the best songs to finish off an album like i just have such a hype like just vibe on me and i'm super energetic right now you can tell um it's just so so cool and i just really enjoy it as a song god i love this album it's so good it's just so so good it's crazy <laughs> I love it. I hope you guys enjoyed me going through the revamped uh, album. It was for sure uh, needed because I love it and it's just so it's refreshed in a way. There's not many things changed. There's a lot of nice effects. I think on Melody's high note there was like a nice extension kind of effect so it can blend with the guitar as well that part. Didn't mention it. I thought I should mention it now. Um, I just love how clean that song was as well. But like yeah all the effects they've had like a bit of distortion more a bit of here there on the guitar and the bass like all these small changes just perfected the songs and just gave us something really nice fresh but close to the original that you love it in a way that it, I, I, I can't explain it it's so cool <laughs> it is a really nice revamped uh version of the originals it's so cool it's so nice i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did make sure to like subscribe click the bell for notifications albert over here will be sending you and i'll see you guys next time in my next commentary Bye bye